I'm with Travis Ria at the Brava booth, and you have an interesting, I'm going to call it an oven. Is that a correct description? It's an oven that's not actually an oven. Yeah, it does a lot more than an oven. It can act like an oven, but it does so much more. The Brava was built, it cooks with infrared lights. So these lights were originally designed for the solar industry. They're very powerful. They can melt metal in a matter of seconds. They go from ambient to full power in less than one second. So Brava is powerful enough to sear steaks, but also gentle and controllable enough to poach eggs. It also gives you three independent cooking zones within the chamber itself, so you can cook. So he's holding a, a what looks like a cookie sheet, and it says one, two, three on it. Yeah, so there's three different zones, and you can cook up to three different ingredients at the same time on the same tray with totally different levels of doneness, i.e. Oh, wow. like a steak with potatoes and asparagus, or a steak with broccoli and cauliflower. Wait, we've got 8,500 recipe programs underneath the hood, and because we're powered by software and connect to Wi-Fi, it gets better every week. We push new recipes to it every Tuesday, and about once a month we do software updates. So what we're so I'm looking at something that's about the size of maybe a color laser printer is where exactly I've described it. the size, and it's got a, a handle on the front, and we've got some uh, light up buttons on top, and a big green uh, circular light might might mean go. I'm going to show you the reheat function here. So we have a camera that you can see that turns on right there that you'll be able to monitor everything from the app. So that since it's got an opaque uh, front, since it's infrared light, you don't want all that leaking out, I guess. Originally, yes, but uh, we actually launched in August of last year a version with a glass door. Oh. So that you can see the light show that's going on inside. Okay, that's kind of crazy. So the one we're looking at has a, a, a display on the top showing us that it's cooking. That's correct. Okay. They, all, they all have the camera. Um, even the version that has the door. So you said it, it doesn't take time to heat up? No, no, no preheat is required. At Wait, all. You but can that's a, probably going to save energy, isn't it? A lot of energy. You can cook a whole meal in Brava in less time and with less energy than it takes to preheat your regular oven. Well, I know our oven takes forever to preheat, so that, <laughs> that wasn't that high of a bar to step over, but I get your point. Yeah, yeah it stays cool to the touch. Um, and again, we're doing software updates all the time. So there, what it is today will be very different than what it will be in three months. We're working on some other assistive technology features like voice to text so that the blind and people with low vision will be able to cook really for the first time safely and independently. Now you mentioned before we started rolling uh, digital bits here that uh, you had some feedback from people uh, working with people with autism? Yeah, yeah. So uh, it, we originally we didn't originally design Brava for the assistive technology community. We launched it in 2018 and it wasn't until the middle of 2023 that we started seeing some orders coming in from a couple of places in Massachusetts that were helping people with intellectual disabilities. And so we got on the phone with them, asked, what, what's going on? How are you doing this? They told us, and we trained all of their physical therapists and occupational therapists, and we started seeing orders coming in that we spread the word out in Massachusetts, and now we're here trying to learn from the community so that we can make Brava just more powerful and better for the assistive tech user. Wait a minute, you want to learn from the community instead of assuming that you know better? That's weird. Yeah, yeah, we, we <laughs> yes. <laughs> Caught him off guard there. So if you uh, stop this for a second, can you show us what a, what, like what a recipe looks like, how you how you get into that? Oh, absolutely. So again, we've got a display that's across most of the, the top of the device here. So there's a lot of ways that you can find things. We can go into the cook feature, which gives you all of our basic categories, like chicken, beef, pork, eggs, frozen foods. All right, I want to make a poached egg. OK. Easy enough. So he tapped on eggs. Oh, I got fried. Oh, no, maybe I want a frittata. Oh, we're talking. OK, poached eggs, fine. So you can tell it anywhere from one to four eggs, and it's going to have the touch screen is going to show you where to place them on the tray. So they've got a specialized uh, egg tray that's got four big pockets, and you just drop the eggs in there, and then you tell it which ones. Okay. This is your personalization slider, so that if you want it to be a little more or a little less done than the default setting, you can do that, and it will save that feature for you. Can I cook the three eggs differently? You could, but it would require some manual... Messing around. Messing okay, around. not using this. Okay. Um, right here is your screen that's telling you which shelf to put it on because there's two shelves and lower and an upper. And then last is sort of like your prepare to launch screen. It gives you all of your selections that you've made. What's really cool is that within about three months, all of this that I did on the touch screen, you'll be able to do on our mobile app so that you people that with low blind or low vision and blindness won't have to use the touch screen at all. 
Oh, that's fantastic. Now, the other thing you mentioned uh, earlier on is that it can sear steak. How, how does that work? I thought, does this cook from above and below? How does it work? It does. It cooks from above and below using the lamps that were originally designed for the solar industry. So like I said, they go from ambient to full power in less than a second. And at full power, they're over 4,000 degrees at the core of the bulb. But what we're really cooking with here is light energy. Uh, we're using a little bit of conduction when we hit it from the bottom. But when we hit it from the top with the lamp, that energy is going directly into the food rather than spending the energy trying to heat the chamber itself. So that's where we get a lot of the efficiency and the power that you could never get in a regular oven or even on the stovetop. And to sear, you said you're, you just shoot up the, from the bottom, right? Yeah, that's correct. But you also have a glass tray, which lets you shoot from the top and the bottom at the same time. That's correct. And the glass tray is really unique because it acts more of like a true heat sink. With the metal tray, I get the benefit of conduction across the whole tray. With the glass tray, it really keeps things unique in their zone. So I can do something like a seared salmon with super crispy skin right next to cherry tomatoes that are barely bursting. Oh, wow. And so if you tried to do that same cook on the metal tray here, it wouldn't work. So I started to stick my hand in there just to, to point at the lights for Steve's video, and it's hot in there. It gets warm. Yeah, it, it's warm. I mean, would it burn my finger if I touched the light bulb? Absolutely. Okay. Don't do that. Okay, so don't ever stick your hand in. Assume it's like an oven and hot inside. It is like an oven. It does God, get it was hot. magic, it, and it never got hot. Would, it, no, it does get hot inside, because we are cooking. We are generating heat. It's just that radiant heat is not the main method of cooking that we're using here. Gotcha, gotcha. So now Brava is uh, actually available today then? Yeah, yeah. We've In been the, around since 2018. Where, uh, what would be the price point on this? It starts at $1,295. Okay, all right. And uh, energy costs, that's about a month and a half of savings. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm kidding. Maybe not that bad, but soon. Here's the trick. We, we tell people you will end up cooking at home so much more than you were before because we make it faster, easier, and more convenient. And so I think in a matter of months, it honestly pays for itself just by not even ordering takeout or going out to eat. Interesting. I like it. And uh, where would people go to find it? www.brava.com. B-R-A-V-A.com. Thank you very much. This Thank is you awesome. so much. Yeah, pleasure meeting you.